Uh, so, hello everybody, what is going on? Today is Kiba Shimaki here, and welcome back to some more, um, well, Kirby Superstar. The game mode is the wonderful Great Cave Offensive. Last time, we finished up the castle area, obtaining our 46th, 47th and 46th treasure here in the crystal area. And all that's left is to wrap things up. Whew. Be ready because there is a lot to do. And I mean a lot. Before we pick and choose, each of them practically all leads somewhere different. Where we're going to want to go first is, I believe, this area. Because whew, what we can obtain here is... Oh, give me. There we go. It's a handful. First, we're going to want to take care of this. Um, I believe the right one we're going to want to knock down is this one. Even though we miss out on a 1-up, we'll come back for that later. Come on. Drop, drop down. Put over here. Obtain another chest. Which houses the Platinum Ring. Go. Gotta go back now. Go, leave, and then re-enter. Then let's do that again so we can obtain the 1-up this time. Go, don't have to worry about anything to the right. Grab that. So now we at least have one extra life. So we are down to two. Go, leave. Cutting this doesn't bring much. Can't remember. No. There we go. Jet, come back. Here we get ourselves a Maximato. Go. Let's run along. Falling down here will lead us. Yep, in this area. Be careful with where you fall. This whole area is quite literally meant to just annoy you and send you back to the top. Go. No. I don't even know how I jumped there. Fall. Fall. Fuck. Fall. 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 You. Smack you. Fall down. Go. Take care of you. Obtain this. We get ourselves the Triforce. A wonderful reference to the Legend of Zelda. Which is not bad. This area, of course... We're going to be back at the later, because this is more so the final area we need to visit. Boom. Go flying right onto the top. Go. Go, got to make way past you guys again. Got to go get Jet once more, and then we can fully explore. Drop you. Go. Boom. Now let's run back. No. Let's run back. Boom. Let's go get Cutter. Go. Let's run, run, run. Thank you. Nope. Come on, Jet. Oh, and I believe over here is just a bunch of other areas, yeah, that we gotta get through. Actually, this one is easier, so let me do this one first, now that I remember. Boom. Damn, I'm really bad at aiming. Boom. Come on! Okay. Seriously? Thank you. Boom. Get this. Where is Hannah the Pegasus Wing? Over here, slam right through, slam right there, down. Boom. Come on. No! Thank you. There we go. Boom, I 
to the end. Here. No! Run back. Go. As good as Wheelie would be here. So we hold out because our good buddy Bugsy is here. Go. Die, 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 die! Boom. Saying this, we get ourselves the raccoon doll. Hey, not bad. Um, toss that so we get some kibble. Sure, we'll take. I guess we won't take suplex. That's fine. Let's check around. Boom. Take wheelie now, because why not? We really have no other choice. Follow the way through. And here. Avoid as much as possible. I think there were a few healing items, of course. Nothing. Ugh. Yep, as expected, we're low on HP. Boom. Toss that. Let's get Wheelie as our ally to take you. Boom. Do that, kill all those enemies, or kill what we can before we get KO'd ourselves. Damn it! <sighs> okay, well, might as well do this since I'm already over here. Let's go. Like I said, there's a lot of back and forth in these coming areas. So, really, just the main area that we're not going to be returning to all that much is going to be this one. This takes us to the end, and we're not quite ready for that, so. Just gonna have to hold out a bit. Boom. I'll see you. No, you f Toss you. Stop being a douche. God damn it. Boom. Run. Alright. Now let's go ahead and let's give the other area a try. I know I'm switching back and forth between a lot of these and I normally shouldn't, but that's because a lot of these, this area has a lot of us need to interact with various other areas that we visited. Right here, if you hold down, that one is slightly lighter, so you're able to drop down and obtain this treasure. We get ourselves the charm. Not bad. Now uh, let's rise back up. Boom, slime you. Are you kidding me? You actually got stuck right there. Go. Go. Now let's fall right here. Fire! See where we land? In this area. No, 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 no. Boom. Click this. We obtain ourselves the x mystery. Not bad. Nope. Come on. Go. On through. Okay. Oh my god, I can't do well in there. It's fine. Boom. We're slowly filling it out. Come on. Get over here. Not gonna get anything out of that. Boom. Go, let's run, let's run. Jump into this one. Boom! Fire ourselves off into the great beyond. Okay. This area! My god, can it be annoying. There's so much to see, so much to get through, and so many different treasures to collect. Hit this one, you can obtain yourselves. Kong's Barrel. What a good reference to Donkey Kong Country and Donkey Kong himself. Keep on moving. Avoid that for now. You're going to basically want to follow the path of where all the stars are because these stars lead you to where you need to go. Right here. We're going to want to be careful. Damn it. Okay. Let's wait it out. Ooh, that was too close. Wanna jump up and hit that? Ramia's scale, which I'm not sure is a reference to. No. Go do this. All right, all right, we'll wait it out. Drop down now. Stay in the middle. 
to go. We see Capsule J having a little bit of, of fun over there. Jet enjoying itself. Now let's float over this. Jump down, and of course you couldn't jump down the way I hoped you did. Actually, no, this is where we want to go. We're going to fall right here. And we have this little area. Go. Boom. Boom. Get ourselves right here a Maximato, which is very much needed. There are no hidden treasures in here, of course. I've tried before. So, really, no point in wasting your time too much there. Um, I believe here. Fall right here. Jump through here, and we're in this area. We can't get the treasure chest here because we need wheelie to access it so that'll give us some time or that'll be a while until we try head right over here scale up and we obtain we get to this area where now we can actually use wheelie boom jump right on our partner all right now this is a matter of being fast and i am not that wait for it Boom, boom. Damn it, I jumped too early. Yep. This is a complete time based one, so you gotta move quick. Nope. Wasn't ready. I don't think I extended it. Nope. But the reason why we need wheelie in that other area is because with wheelie you can jump as many times as you want and it's feeling. It reads it as a first jump. Damn it. Too early. Boom, boom, let it ride out. There we go. Go, land right here. We obtain the tire. Not bad. Let's drop down, hop back on wheelie. Let's just go with the wheelie rider. Boom. Run through. And now we go back to obtain that other one that we skipped out on. Nope, nope. Come on. God damn it. There you go. Start jumping. Get right through the center. Go, share the wheelie, jump across. We get ourselves the shiny bamboo. Not bad. Check our items and we see we have only a few left. Let's run along. Keep on moving through what is left for us. Go. Maybe we want to jump right up. Go to the right. Here. Follow. Oh, right. I can't do anything here, can I? Yeah, no, I can't do anything. Yeah. Forget. Yeah. Gotta come back here when I have a different ability. Or at least an ability that it basically attacks the ground. Sleep ain't gonna do nothing for me, so we can't really do much with that. Come on now, wake up, Kirby. Go, fall through here. We can get ourselves Parasol, because that's gonna help a lot. Where is the damn... Come on, jeez. Ah. <sighs> Oh, here. Okay. Get out of the way. This. We obtain ourselves the spirit charm. Nice. Go. Wheelie is your best friend in a lot of these areas. Go. Go back right up here. Nope. Go, fall right down. And all these items share a little bit of wheelie. We get ourselves another one up. It is possible to have a lot more lives than I do now, but of course, I just don't have the best luck with it, so it's fine. So now let's drop down, hop on the warp star, and let's return. Collect it all that we can in that area. Whew. Now all we have left is the area to the right. 
make. I don't know, we have one more that I skipped over. I um, whoa, I, how did I forget? I completely forgot one of the... No, no, I didn't forget the chest. Duh. Just a dingbat. Alright, run over here. Alright, now we can fully explore this place. Oh god, I forgot. I'm not supposed to attack you like that. Let's just drop straight down. Straight down. I said straight. I said straight down, damn it. Left. Down. Bottom right. There we go. Go. We got wheelie. Let's go ramming through our enemies. Okay. Jump. Yep. Oh my. I hate that you can still hit me. Okay, they're not meant to do that, but that works. Nope. S stop. Give me this. We'll take Suplex Kirby with us. God damn, I wanted to hop on you. Go, just so we can round the rest of these enemies out of the way. Go on through. Jump high. Boom. Give you Bugsy's ability. Nope. Ooh, okay. This is not good. Okay, cool. I can just remember to check here. Another one up. Some more health. Oh god. Go. Grab this. Move. We get another shell whistle. Whistle, which is in very close resemblance to uh, certain. Uh, uh, I was gonna say ghost type, uh, water type Pokemon. That uh, we all know. Go, jump along. Anything else along here? More health that I could use. Boom. Go. Ugh. Oh, bad timing. Give me that. Oh. No, Bugsy. You're gonna go down. Unfortunately. Oh, I remember. Go. No, I needed to grab you. Run over here. Oh god, I was way too close. Give me this. Let's go grab this Maximato. No, I didn't want to use it yet. Well, maybe you can still work with it. Go, cool. Made it. Slap that. Get this. And boom. The or the Orhalcon. Which is interesting. But with that, we obtained our last treasure. There's nothing more to really note or see. This is just a whole wraparound that can let us avoid all that. You can, of course, skip all these treasures and go straight for the end. However, what's the real point in doing that? Nothing. What you want to do is... Try and collect them all, collect as many as you can, and make it to the end. I want to go ahead and save, just so that way in case I end up somehow getting a game over, I don't miss out on it. Let's go on, let's run along. Here we go. Make it to the last area. To take on the final boss. I don't really need any abilities right now because we are going to get some coming up. Drop down, drop down, damn it. Drop down, drop down. No! I'm like trying to remember like the pattern. Drop down. No, okay, I jumped right into that one. You suck. I hate these gyms. No! Okay, drop down right here. Drop down right there. There. Run along. We enter. I will have. Hobby Bros Jr. as my ally, and I will have Poppy Bros as myself as well. No, nope. I want Poppy Bros. No, thank goodness I can get that. Okay, here we go. Sake on the last boss.
This boss can be quite annoying. It is the Witch Doctor. That is what he's referred to as. Try to avoid his attacks. Uh, you can really only hit his hands. His face cannot cause damage to you. Of course, your allies are going to probably go down in a bunch of different ways. Because they're your allies, that's what they do. If you are very familiar with... Um, if you're very familiar with um, Smash Rose, then you have a good idea of how this boss is going to work. But you should be okay. Go, just smack him out of the way. Boom. Boom. Ugh. Go. Go. Oh god. Give me this. Oh, that was too close. No, can turn around. Say hi. No. No. I messed up. Damn it. <laughs> that upsets me. Right, let's go back. Get Poppy Gross Jr. as an ally. Have him not mess us up, please. Go. Take him with us. Let's run and fight. You're not going to want to jump right off the bat because you can't actually get hit by his face since it does have a slight detection. Or you could just get hit by nothing for some reason and have it knocked out of you immediately. I don't understand it sometimes either. Go. Go. To avoid the rocks. Oh god. Go. 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 Boom, just smack the hell out of all of these. Boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. Go. Oh god. Go. One more good hit should do it. Go, just stay in the corner. I come from the. Oh, never mind. Whatever. The bomb traded. It took care of the doctor. We are good as gone to leave. Get our last Maximato. We ride the trolley one more time. Run over all these enemies. Get to make it to the end. Whew! God, this game mode is absurdity. Boom. Ride the elevator to victory. Let's go on this ring of Poppy Bros with us, why not? Go. Go up. Smack you. Let me see. We're right back at the entrance. We jump onto the warp star and we get on out of here. Boom. And just like that, we see all the different treasures we've collected the gold medals, the gold coins, the whips, and so and so. My god, this game mode was absurd. I'm so glad to be done with it. Holy crap, it took way longer than I thought it was. <sighs> There's a lot of different game references. The screwball there to Metroid. Um, and a lot of things just in notes. But I had a lot of fun playing through this. This was fun, and all honesty, I'm really hoping that you guys actually got an idea of where everything is. Honestly, I thought I was going to beat this in four parts. I thought I was going to just get through all of the castle in one, but damn, I forget how giant the castle is and how much you need to get through. <sighs> how much of everything there was. Ugh. But like, yeah. Uh, whew. I'm so glad I got through that. So glad I finished. Feels so relieving that it's done. We see the ancient gem, a, re ref a little reference, even though it's not really there. Reference to Okami, Falcon Helmet, Captain Falcon, and F-Zero. 
Uh, let's see what else. Turtle Shell, reference to Mario. The sword, which in Japan, in the Japanese version, was called the Falchion, which is a reference to Fire Emblem. The Warrior Shield, which can be taken a reference to Dragon Warrior, which is pretty good. Um, at least that's what I think. Tut's Mask, that's Tut's Mask. Mr. Saturn, a wonderful reference to Earthbound. Because who doesn't love themselves a good old-fashioned Earthbound game? Um, I had a lot of fun playing through this. God damn, that was annoying. There was so much to get through in the Great Cave Offensive. I didn't think it was going to take that long, but I got it done. I collected every treasure. I feel good. All that's left is the two new bonus modes that had opened up to us, which is the wonderful, wonderful Meta Knight's Revenge. And the ever so dreadful Milky Way Wishes. Kong's Barrel, DK Country, or Donkey Kong in general. Spirit Charm, which I'm not sure. The Pegasus Swing. The Raccoon Doll could be a reference to Mario, but also Animal Crossing. The Shell Whistle. We have our good buddy Slowbro and Slow King from Pokemon. And the Triforce, of course, from The Legend of Zelda. Treasures found, 60 out of 60. Total, 9,999,990 gold. Congratulations! Of course, this little end screen doesn't change too much. It only changes when you collected no treasures, to which I wonder how in the world did you go through this game mode without collecting a single one? Well, I mean, it's possible. But with that, that marks the end of the Great Cave Offensive. Next time, we tackle Meta Knight's Revenge. We see just where things go from here. Hope you guys did enjoy. Hope you guys continue to enjoy. And I will, of course, see you all next time. Peace out, everybody.